Hello, I'm Will Rubottom from Staffordshire and I'm a young farmer and more recently people might know me from starting my YouTube channel Cowley Hill Farm. So the flock of sheep here at home, they're predominantly pedigree clean ewes and we've got 220 ewes at the moment. I've built that up over the last eight years from five ewes and I've bred my own replacements to where I am today. The business model here at home is predominantly based on the hay and haylage business and the sheep are used to manage the grass throughout the winter months and to try and improve the sward. My interest in digital media started when I was a little bit younger and I followed different people on the internet on YouTube and that kind of got me into it and got me interested for what I wanted to start on my own. The drivers of the YouTube channel really came from me developing the flock at home and trying to get myself out there a little bit more. At the start when I was a pedigree breeder you have to need to try and get your name out there a little bit so that is why I started the channel to try and show the sheep off and what we do here on the farm at home. So my videos, I try and make them educational, but at the same time show them the real life stories here at home. I try and show them the real highs as well as the real lows, because at the end of the day, the farm isn't always a happy place. Sometimes you do have bad stuff happen and I want people to realize that happens. My farming and media passions come together as I'm trying to advertise the flock at home, as well as trying to educate people about what happens on the farm. At the Farm Business and Innovation Show, I'm aiming to show people my real life story of how I developed what I do today on the farm, how the sheep came from nothing to growing up to 220 years, as well as trying to tell people how they could do it themselves and how easy it can be. And getting technology onto your farm at home really shows the general public of what you get up to and it can show the real life stories that happen on a farm. So what I'd say is important for people to hear is that technology is quite new in agriculture and to take that on board and embrace it is a great thing. Hopefully delegates will take away some confidence from me showing you how simple it can be. At the end of the day I started what I did from nothing and it's a, just such an easy thing to grasp hold of and show off what you've got at home.